We're all really excited that Google Analytics is rolling out these new benchmarking reports throughout the fall. So I'm going to show you how to find them real quickly. Go log into Analytics. Over here under Audience, you'll see that there's a new open uh, table here that you can look under Benchmarking. Here you'll see Channels, Location, and Devices. Those are the three buckets that um, Analytics is immediately letting you access. Once you do that, you can come here and look at the top and pick some different things that you want to compare to. So they've got a ton of different industry verticals in here. We're lucky enough that there is actually jobs in education, education, colleges and universities, and then we can look at all colleges and universities. So it gives us a really nice look at just our sector of the market. Um, some other industries don't necessarily have quite a nice segment, so we're, we're really positive on the fact that that is there for us. You can also look at um, all different types of regions. So I'm default to the United States, but if you wanted to look internationally or if you wanted to look specifically within um, your state, there's that ability too. So you can see that the states are all broken out in here as an option. You can also look um, and change some options here of the different sizes. So I'm defaulted into right now the 100 to 500 because I'm currently in Converge Consulting's account. Um, it'll default you into sort of where you belong. Um, and then additionally, you can change that based on the number of sessions that each of these websites are getting. So it's going to let you compare, really try to get close to the, the type of colleges and universities that are getting similar traffic to what you are. And you also have a note here that says how many are actually um, in that uh, benchmarking group. So we have 478 right now that we're being compared against. So now the real magic happens if you scroll down a little bit. You see um, first the benchmark session up here above and then this is your actual sessions below in the darker blue. And um, we're going to have this nice graph down below that shows us visually kind of a heat map of where we're doing better than, than the benchmark and where we're doing not as good as the benchmark um, with percentages there. Obviously, I'm comparing and Converge Consulting's consulting website to some colleges, so you're going to see some a little bit more red probably than in some cases. But basically, we can go look at the different channel groupings. It looks like we're doing better than average in um, email acquisition uh, and worse than average in all these other categories of the different default channel groupings that Analytics uses. Um, also, go over here and click back and forth between location and you can see obviously the United States is broken out there and uh, devices. So we can see the device categories and compare how many people are going you know desktop, tablet or um, mobile phone. There we go. And the traffic coming from those different devices. Some of you are going to go into this report and you're going to see this. Um, basically what this means is that you haven't checked a checkbox on the back end that says when you set up your account, yeah, we're okay with sharing anonymously our information with Google and others. And basically what this means is they're not going to share information with you if you're not willing to share information with them. So you can easily click through on this link and go through and update those sharing settings um, and then you should start to see that reporting come in. Of course, it's going to all be anonymously shared and any identifiable information is going to be pulled out of there. Thanks.